Yeah, within the past hour, Lisa, but for most of the morning, the only things moving through this intersection uh, were bucket trucks and hoisting equipment. Traffic lights were grounded here at 27 and East Alexandria Pike for quite some time in Cold Spring. We're told a collar on the signal pole broke, causing a strand of lights to fall. It's unclear if the icy weight of winter was a factor, but except for the treated roadway, there was an ice coating just about everywhere else, on the grass, on branches, buildings, poles, and the traffic signals themselves. And as crews worked to pull the down lines into place again and get them operating red, yellow, and green, unsuspecting drivers had to choose, wait it out or turn around and find another way. Truckers, nearby residents, a newspaper delivery man, a chiropractor who had to close his corner business, and an Uber driver whose fare had to hoof it on slippery sidewalks to get to him on the other side of the blocked intersection. I kind of took a flip of the coin of driving this morning. I was like, eh, maybe, maybe not. But it looks like I'm going to get to pull this, pick this guy up. Now the Uber and his passenger headed back to the city, back into Cincinnati as some fairly rapid progress was made to get these traffic signals back up to their normal directional level. Uh, work that required precision, plenty of human muscle, and I must say time. It took some three plus hours to do it, but the intersection is now reopened. Reporting live in Cold Spring, John London, WLWT News 5. Okay.